If you're looking for some quality traditional Italian food on the go, then this story's for you. Adam Wurzel's got the scoop. Take a look at this map, Italy. The boot-shaped country that's home to some of the best food in the world. And now there's a food truck right in our town, though we're a bit more known for cowboy boots. When I moved here from Long Island to Nashville, we started an ice cream truck. And I just wasn't fulfilled with the ice cream truck. I needed to cook. I truly enjoy making people happy through my food, and I love to cook. This is Pase Italiano, created by Amy Persibali Lasinski in February of this year. This Italian kitchen on wheels is serving traditional recipes with fresh ingredients that have been passed down from an all-Italian family. I like to call it Northeast Italian food, and um, basically it's, it's a lot of seasoning, a lot of flavor, a lot of ideas that just are born in our commissary. As we're cooking things, we try out new things. The staple that we have here are the meatballs. The recipe is 126 years old. Uh, they're made fresh daily. Um, we do stuff the meatballs with a lot of different ingredients, cheeses and spices and tomatoes and jalapenos and try and have a little fun with that. And speaking of fun, check out this menu. Pase Italiano could have named their dishes simply meatballs or chicken parm, but like any good group of Italians, it's all in the family. Frankie, forget about it. It's named after my brother Frank. Um, the Joey Meatballs is named after my son Joey. Uh, the Vinnie Boombots is named after my Uncle Vinnie. You may think you get the picture, but your Pase Italiano experience isn't complete until you try what could be considered the best sauce around. The secret to a good sauce is patience, time, and fresh ingredients. San Marzano tomatoes, they come from the volcanic ash uh, grounds in Italy. So all my tomatoes are imported, they're hand squeezed. Um, and the sauce really needs to sit a day or so, and that's when it tastes the best. Whether it's their signature Don fries or their sausage or fall recipe, chicken and peppers, these flavors can come to you. And Pase's owner says that's more personal. Anybody coming to the truck can look up through the window. They can talk to the chef. They can talk to the servers. They can ask any questions they want, and they can actually watch their meal being made versus in a brick and mortar. It's behind a door. Cooking is something that I guess I overlooked in my younger years. This is what I needed to be doing all of my life. This is, this is, they say if you enjoy what you do, you never work a day in your life. I feel like I don't work anymore. Amen to that. And for more information about Pase Italiano and for their upcoming locations, go to PazeItaliano.com.